Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel. So today, as you can guess, we're finally trying out these bad boys. One of you guys actually, I'm drinking Hello Kitty <laughs> um, today. One of you guys actually told me, you know, it'd probably be better off if I use stainless steel straws instead because it's better for the environment. So I went ahead and bought some. Mmm. It tastes like cherry coke. Okay. Now for the reveal. <laughs> ah. And I actually put um, cheese on top of it. So it just has some purple, purple rice cake. And then, yummy. But before we get into this, here's the MacBook for the giveaway. <laughs> Yay, MacBook giveaway. You have to be following me on Instagram, um, and you just need to be active on my socials. So liking posts, um, commenting, all that sort of stuff. And then, yeah, I will be announcing the winners in um, a couple of weeks because I'll be in California. Actually, when I release this video, I should already be in California. So yeah, I'll be in a couple of weeks. Um, it is a MacBook, guys. Costs a lot of moolah. So. It is going to be a little bit um, before I announce the winners. And yeah, I will also be posting a sp specific picture of me and the MacBook. Just make sure to like and comment underneath that as well. I'm going to be choosing someone who's very active, so make sure to be that person. <laughs> okay, so I put some ears on for the occasion. <laughs> Let's finally have a bite of this. Oh, and some of you are commenting saying that I changed the way that I eat with my chopsticks. I've said these in my videos before, but I understand that not everyone watches my videos, like my full videos, so that's fine. I'll repeat myself. It's not that big of a deal. Um, but I only started learning uh, chops how to use chopsticks when I was 11 because that's when I finally met my dad. Um, my dad's the one that's Chinese. So I'm still consistently changing the way my grip is um, because I'm still trying to figure out a way I feel most comfortable and so if you notice my grip changing throughout my videos that's why um, youtubers that I really like to watch are food tales that I love the way they hold their chopsticks um, so I'll watch them a lot of the time or like other youtubers and just try to switch it up and I encourage you to do the same thing but anyways let's eat I'm freaking hungry I've been dying to try this carbonara noodle mmm Hmm, okay. So, right away, these legit taste like, um, let me take a look at them. These honestly taste exactly like the stew type noodle without, like, with just, with, without basically it being a stew. Just the powder and the fire chicken sauce, it tastes exactly like that so if you can't get these ones and you see the stew ones just eat it with the powder and the red sauce and we literally have the same thing <laughs> my purple cheesy rice cake here You know, if you ever go to an Asian market, you'll see that they're selling like the sweet potato there. If you ever eat one of those, literally tastes identical to this. Can't really tell on camera, but in person, it is super purple. <laughs> Mm 
Mm. I'd like to give a shout out to Julie because I totally forgot to last time. Thank you so much for sending me these. I love you. I can't wait to meet up with you. I know we're going to have fun. <laughs> so yeah. So good. It literally tastes like Coke cherry, I think. Would be a good. Whoops. Make my nails. I think black actually might be my new favorite nail color. When I was in high school, I would do black sometimes, but I felt like, like one Con Conrad, I heard that the hills they're gonna be doing, like maybe a get together or whatever. Um, one Cara would always do dark blue on her nails. Like, I loved when she did that. And sometimes she would do black. Um, and, uh, but she, she just made it so, like, fashionable, you know? However, I have been a bit emo lately. And when I was a kid, I did paint my nails black because I was super emo. But, um, now I think it's just, like, I didn't think I could really pull it off back then. The way LC did it. But now I feel like, Lauren Conrad, now I feel like I can pull it off. Excuse me. But the girl, mm -mm. but the girl, she did a really bad job on my shape. But I like her, like, I like her so much, and she was just so busy, so I didn't want to say anything. But, and I've been nice lately, like, because a lot of you guys were telling me that I, sh in my story times, I should be nicer to people. It's not that I'm not nice, it's just that I don't like to put up with, like, when I feel like someone didn't do me right, I just don't like to put up with the BS, so I voice my opinion right away. But lately, I've just been like, okay, I'm going to let it go. But the next time I see her, for her to do my nails, she needs to, like, rectify the situation. Like, I'm going to be nice about it, but, yeah. <sighs> These fish cakes are so good. Mm. When I get back, Aria promised me to answer your guys' questions. Ooh. So, that's going to happen when I get back from California. I'm going to do a video together. <clears throat> He's always working, so it's hard. And he's super camera shy, so... I really like the sweet with the fire noodle. 
It's good. My favorite fish cakes to buy for sure. Okay, guys, that's everything. Anyways, hopefully by the time you see me next, my hair is dyed because my sister, as you guys know, is the person to dye my hair. And my sister is dyed my hair, so I cannot wait. Anyways, I love you guys so much. And if you didn't notice already, there is some construction happening on the banner. Take a look at that. Take a look at the girls. Something new is coming. And I'm really excited for it. So hopefully you guys are too. Okay, chicken wangs. I think that's what we're going with. We are going with chicken wangs. I love it. I love you guys so much. Woo! And until next time.